excited about 2016. Uh, just got so many things going on with our Murfreesboro Junior Golf Initiative. That's kind of an in-house tagline. Uh, but just, just in early January, we started at uh, John Pittard Elementary School with our in-school, it's a pilot program. We call it Chippers, seven life skills that we feel that the game of golf engages young people with. Confidence, honesty, integrity, perseverance, respect, responsibility, and sportsmanship. And the introduction to the game is a, is a pretty soft introduction. We're using you know, a lot of different uh, efforts throwing the ball around, kicking the ball, using soft hockey equipment, and just gradually letting them evolve into, you know, maybe getting them out on the Bloomfield links in the spring. I have a great friend of mine that says, you know, the greatest thing about coaching, it doesn't matter what the sport is, when you get somebody standing in front of you you've never met before, you know, there's a challenge, you know personalities, so on and so forth. But in age levels, going from kindergarten to like fifth grade, like we're doing at Pittard, it still has some connection. There's links between the programs in the sense that with our youngsters, we were just rolling the ball out with the kindergartner, but it was target oriented. And uh, that's one of our basic starts in any of our programs. It, it also all starts with aim. And so we always use the, you know, the call letters of the Professional Golfers Association, but in our program we call PGA, we say posture, grip, aim. The three basic tenets of you know, finding a way to step into this game. So right off the bat, the aiming, and, and, and then having the, the peers and splitting them into groups, that's been just a, just a winner. You know, we start the program out and we're playing hockey with, uh, you know, we're running around and, and we're just, we're doing things that the, the, the kids think, well, you know, gosh, is this golf? It really has some ties. To get the word out about the game of golf, I explained to my young people a lot of times, last year's Super Bowl, you know, they finish up the game in and, and, uh, New England and Seattle and they're having a fist fight in the end zone. And I have a picture on my desk. I have Tiger and Phil Mickelson just walked off the last green of the U.S. Open, shaking hands, got their hats off. You know, it, it just to bring those kind of things to people's attention that don't even play golf, but just let them understand, like the seven life skills we're talking about, the game has so much ability to bring that directly or indirectly to, to the young people of this community. Again, I've been in, in September of this year, I'll be a 40 year golf professional, a member of the PGA, and I still, it just is beyond, I'm still having to tr struggle to wrap my arms around what we do have. But as I introduced to the Pittard uh, Elementary School, the program goes right up through May, and what we're trying to do is show you that you can literally come out to Bloomfield Links and for $5, $5, you don't have to have clubs, we'll provide those. You don't have to have golf balls, we'll provide those. And then you walk over to the Bloomfield Links, our six hole developmental course, and you can play six holes, you could play 60 holes, you could play all day and for $5. And there's nowhere that I know of that has anything like that. And uh, just the people in Murfreesboro got really, really, and we're gonna continue to do our due diligence to get the, you know, to get that word out.